Okay, while we wait on Captain Eagle Eye, we're going to get another picture of the Spitfire. Looking good. And there's the BF-110. Which, for those of you that are into this conspiracy theory stuff, the BF-110 is only one molecule away from being a BF-109. And we all know about the BF-109. So, there it is. That's what happens when you add one number. Okay, now we got the uh, Captain Eagle Eye, actually it's Commander Eagle Eye, I don't know who demoted him, uh oh, he's, he's, mo he's moving over, yeah I didn't connect the aileron, oh no, it's not finished, didn't connect the aileron, well let me tell you, if you think these planes are fun to fly, for every 10 minutes that you fly them, you spend two hours working on them. That's what we call a poor return on investment. Okay. Did you check to make sure they were hooked up correctly? Okay, that's, there you go. Do right again, I didn't see right. Okay. Okay, there you go. Let's rock. Okay, we're going to rock this wind with a glider. We're going to show the wind who, uh oh. We're going to show the wind who's the boss. Who the boss? Who the boss? And there he goes. Wow, look at that. Holy moly. Man, when you got that much wind, I mean, that much wing. It went up like it was being jerked up by a string. Uh oh. We got a real problem here, Commander Eagle Eye. The sky is white and your plane is white. Yeah. Okay, that helps. The, the shadow underneath helps a lot. Oh, look here. Not only are we hovering, but I think we're going backwards. This comes out good on the video because I can barely see that baby. Uh oh. There we go. It's back. Uh oh. It's, there's back. Yeah, it blends into those clouds. Yeah, I got motor off. It's just black. Wow. It's going for a close up. This is gliding with no power. And as you recall earlier, I mentioned it had a 49 inch, 50 foot wingspan. Eight foot. No, oh, eight foot, okay. I missed it a few. That's okay, there's no truth in advertising anyway. Whoa. You know, we may have to take an intermission because if he's gonna glide like this, that battery's probably gonna last two, three hours. And I don't believe my shoulders can hold this camera up for that long. I don't think we can hold your attention for that long. Sure can't hold mine for that long. Because I got ADD. Now fortunately, it hasn't been diagnosed. Otherwise they put me in the goofy bin. Whoa! I don't know, he's going straight up or straight down? He's going up. He's definitely going up. Well, this is gonna, this is gonna make the landing really interesting. Whoa, is that a roll? Holy moly. Getting that 60 foot wingspan to roll like that is a minor miracle in itself. And now I've lost it. Okay, where'd he go? We're gonna look around. Slow it. Oh man. Okay, I've got white blindness. Ricky, I can't find you. Oh, there he is. Oh. Crap, I've lost him again. 
Here, I'll just show you the clouds and stuff while I'm looking for him. Anybody see him? Well, right there, that covers... Now, right there covers a whole lot of sky. Back here, it's back over here. It's going this way. It's right there. I may have to give you the camera. No, I... Oh, there he is. Finally, there he is. Okay, we're back. Rick, you need to set that motor brake when you can. Because it said in the... Uh, in one of the videos I was watching the ASW, they said it works as a motor... and it works as a speed brake. I don't think speed's going to be a problem with this plane, <laughs> but it might. You never know. I wouldn't, not with that wingspan. Wow. Oh. <laughs> do it. Do it into the wind. Well, an area is just stopped. If you get the motor, will it go backwards? Oh, it is cut, okay. There's a guy who just come out for a while. He drove a big silver truck and he had like a man who made this thing. He gets up so high and then come down and make a high uh, speed pass. Mid pick. Woo! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait. Oh no. <laughs> and there he goes. Oh, look at that. It failed right where the carbon tip ended. Well, how about yeah. that? No, not. I mean, that doesn't. That sounds like it just snapped. Yeah. Structural failure. Yeah, when you put glue on that, it'll never fail again there. Okay. Might have a hard time walking with that thing. <laughs> there, Rick's back up. What is this? Spitfire, I think. Is that Spitfire? Yeah. There, uh, it ain't too windy. I just had a little crack up there. Wind got me from behind. Put me in, I'll be ready. And back together in an hour or so. Pulling 10 to 15, maybe a little more up, upstairs. Careful. Beautiful sky, kind of cool, but not too bad. May have some snow later, a little bit of dusting. 
Yeah. It's a little gusty up there. I'm trying to set my simulator with gusty flying it, it helps. Land back. Okay, take it easy. There you go. Ah, look at there, perfect. It's not too windy. It's just right. Just right. <laughs> yep. John went up. Just lifted right off. We got about 15, 20 mile an hour wind now. Not too bad. Not too bad. There he is. Just floats along. I think my glider stalled out on that wind. Beautiful sky coming out. That means it's gonna clear off. It's gonna get cold. Whoa! Oh Lord! Oh Lord! Whoa! Give me that bird can handle it. Bird's inverted. <laughs> Whoa! I'd say it's up about 20 now. There you go. Nice and swift. Very good.
landing somewhere. Come on down, come on down, come on down. There you go, there you go, there you go. He was wanting to go. Kamikaze packing it up. Now the winds are slowing down. So everybody's hiding over here. Oh man, we're trying and we're getting out of the freaking wind. I, I swear you were up there, man. It gusted to about 20, 22 miles an hour. Yeah. The airplanes don't know it's windy up there. <laughs> I tell you what. Did you see his landing? Kept my glider up. That'd have been good. Yeah. Right down. Uh, another good day, Rick. Another good day. This, this training in this high wind does a, does us real good. You know. I think so. Uh, I, I think it's a it's an advantage to us. Sometime. Yeah. I remember the time that when it was this windy out in uh, I'm looking out at the, you know, across the field, and there's a line of trees, and the trees are just going, <laughs> and I'm going, holy cow, and uh, I think that was the day I wrecked my P-38 Lightning when y'all drove up, you know. Is that when it disappeared? Yeah. Jeff Your found P-47. It. Uh, no, yeah, that P-47 is when, that's the one that uh, on, Jeff. your brother found, found on the, the way tree. in. Yeah. And look what I found. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> and y'all probably told him, yeah, Rick's out there looking for me. Yeah, I did. I was walking out in the field and everything.